Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to Noodle. We both said different names. Happy birthday to you. I made some homemade avocado toast. My uh, little breakfast slash lunch since I barely eat like that. But yeah, <laughs> trying to get in this healthy journey, man. Let me give y'all this word of the day, though. Hey, what's up, my lovelies, on this beautiful Saturday, this beautiful Saturday. <laughs> All right, y'all. So I just wanted to quickly come on here and give y'all the word of the day because I got a lot going on today. Um, I already told y'all. Uh, I don't know. I don't even. I don't think I told y'all, but yeah, yesterday was my son. Yeah, I did tell y'all. Did I? I don't remember. Yesterday was my son's birthday. So um, today um, we're gonna be going to uh, the racetrack and having some fun because he want to go to the racetrack and and have some fun. Okay. But with that being said, I got y'all word of the day on this beautiful Saturday, okay? It is hot up in here. Whew. But we thank God for the heat because uh, we know we cannot take that cold, okay? But the word of the day today is patience. Oh, I needed that one. I needed that one. Patience. Patience is a virtue. Most of the time, and I can, I can attest to, to everyone that this has to resonate with you. We all end up losing patience at times because we feel like we don't fought so long. We don't fought so hard. When is it coming? Where is it going to come from? Oh my gosh, I'm impatient now. Come on now. Time is a ticking. Things need to happen. Things need to start, you know, you know, need to start unfolding. But then you see that it's not really happening how you think it should or whatever the case. And you end up losing your patience, man. I want to let y'all know, man, keep the patience. Okay. Stay vigilant. Stay patient, uh, with, 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 filled with patience, because guess what? That's what God works on. He works on faith, and faith, it, it correlates with patience. You have to have patience. So when you have faith and you know that things are going to happen and your favor is going to turn out to be okay and your favor is going to work out in your favor, you know that that connects with the patience. So you have to be patient, patient with and have faith. So not only do I have to have that faith, I have to be patient as well, and I have to wait on the Lord. I have to wait on him to come and be able to give me my fruits and everything, you know, to be able to give me things that is due to me, you know, to be able to, you know, take care of me and take care of it, take care of the situations that people put on the forefront of my brain and in the forefront of my life and everything like that, that was narcissistic, that was negative, that was bullshit, you know? So he got all of that under control, man. Just have patience. Keep doing what you're doing. Keep going. Keep fighting. Keep one foot in front of the other. Remember what we said last time? One foot in front of the other. That's all you got to do. Don't think about nothing else or nobody else, especially nobody else. Stop thinking about other people or you're going to lose sight of where you're trying to go and what you're trying to do. Stop thinking about people because people ain't thinking about you. Okay? Let's let's say that one more time before I hurry up and be three minutes. People ain't thinking about you. Okay? Have some patience, man. Patience is a virtue, man. Don't worry about how far and long somebody else getting to where they're going. Yours is coming. It's already here. I told y'all that, man. Patience is a virtue, man. It's right around that corner. That's all you got to do is have patience. When you give up, you ain't going to never see the fruits. Love y'all. Have a great day, man. Stay prayed up with the most high. And let me go because my hand's shaking. Yeah.